Hey everyone, this is TG from ToyGander.com and today I'm going to show you how to make some custom Lego fidget spinners. Let's go ahead and take a gander. Hey, do you got tiny hands? No problem, I got the perfect fidget spinner for you. Bam! This teeny tiny one. I love this one because it's lightweight, fits in your pocket, you can barely tell it's even there. And it goes on and on. This is like a perfect for kids or, again, if you got small hands, this is right up your alley. Let's uh, deconstruct this one to show you how I made it. Okay, so it has six cap pieces right in the back here, one wheel connector, two wheel hubs, and then this piece right here. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna put a little weight on the ends, because the weight gives it a little bit more, uh, just a little bit more balance so you can, it goes around a little bit longer. So you put all four caps right there, and then just for a little bit more color, I added a two on the ends. And you can actually add two more on the other end just to make it even. I chose not to because I didn't have any. You take this piece, you put it right in the middle right there, just like so. And then you put this cap on here and this cap on here. And there we have spinner number one. Spinner number two. Now I'm calling this one the barrel roll. That's because it's like a solid cylinder. You can see right there. And it actually has more weight to it, so it gives it a little bit more oomph than some of the other ones. It'll spin for a longer time. So let's deconstruct this one and I'll show you how to make it. Very simple ingredients here. You look at these, we actually have six of these total. I have just four of these red and then two black. You could use any colors that you want, it doesn't matter. So at first we connect these two together. I put the black one on the end again. You could use any piece that you want. You put this blue one in the middle. One thing you'll note on this, there's a hole in the middle. This is the only color of this one I had. If I had a different color, I would use a different color. Then you put the black, red, another red. Now the only thing with this, I used a smaller version of this. You can actually use a little bit bigger and you can use different uh, end pieces. I just like these because they're a little bit more streamlined. So you put that on the end like this. Put this on the other end. And you want to leave a little bit of room just so you could continue to spin it. I'll zoom out. There you go. Spinner number three. Now this one's a little bit unorthodox and I don't know if you can technically consider it a fidget spinner. However, it keeps me entertained. Let me show you how to make this one. We can actually put this one together pretty fast. These things go on these things. Bonus points if you know the names of them. And then once you have these things in, Plug them on the ends. Put this in here. Here's the fourth spinner. I don't know what you call it, but this one's my favorite. All right, let me show you how to make this one. You could see all the pieces that we have here. Now, some of these pieces are interchangeable, so if you don't have the exact same thing, don't worry about it. First thing, this is the center piece that goes right here. And then I already put this one together right here. You can kind of see what it looks like or what it should look like. I, I'll do the other one to give an idea. Whoa, whoa, slippery. So there's, there's one right here. And then we put this one right through it. Just like that. And once you have these pieces laid out, then you put this on one side, here's your middle, right like that, and then here's your end right here. And just put this all the way through. Let me zoom out and see if I can. And now you have your base. You'll take this piece, you'll put it through here, right in the middle, One on this side, one on this side. Again, you could change out these. I just like the way that these looked. And there we have that spinner right there. And here are all the spinners together. Time for a few shout outs. Dead X, Gamer X, Rumbler, Raiden Thompson, I Live on Mars, and Sagios. Here's a thumbs up to you. Thank you so much for watching Toy Gander. And guys, it's that time of the video. There's one figure somewhere on the screen that's just not quite right. 
So the first subscriber who finds whatever figure that is and puts it in the comments below, I will give you a shout out in the next video I do. Guys, that's what I have for today. Please make sure you click that subscribe and that little bell icon. That bell icon will notify you anytime I release a video so you can get a jump on it before anybody else. And then also click that thumbs up button. I really do appreciate it. And guys, it's over my 100th video. I really just thank you so much for all the love and support that you guys give. Thank you guys so much. And until next time, you can help us take a gander.